Day one, day sold. We show you everything at Mustang Medic. MustangMedic.com. We take the frustration. We work on, buy, sell, restore, and most of all, love your Mustang. MustangMedic.com delivers gorgeous women once again. MustangMedic.com. We take the frustration out of restoration. 1973 Mustang Convertible. MustangMedic.com. What is your name? Lee. This is Lee. Brotherton. Brotherton. And she's a fine artist, guys. And this is what she does. All right, guys. Lee was one of the people that were selling this car. And she's got a lot of beautiful art. And I just wanted to showcase it. So check it out. And this is, explain it, Lee, for us. This is actually an ammonite fossil that's been filled with pyrite, which is fool's gold. And it's made, it's a, it's a natural formation that was formed 100 to 300 million years ago in the sea. It was a sea creature, and it's from Russia. And so this is a pretty um, amazing fossil because it was filled in with fool's gold. And you created this? The outside piece. This part is a clay-like material that I embed the real fossil in the clay, and then once it's shaped, sanded, <coughs> hardened, I paint it with <coughs> acrylic paint. Uh -huh. So each piece is one of a kind. What, and <coughs> you have a studio? I do. What is the name of the studio? Um, it would be Brotherton, and it's, so it's LeeBrotherton.com, and it's brother. We're in her house. We're, we're, ha we're in her house, so they're, they're getting involved probably because of my dogs, but it's, right. it's oh, Lee. Lee Brotherton. So it's L-E-E-B-R-O-T-H-E-R-T-O-N.com. Okay, and there's a website right below, guys, and you can see that. And here's another, another piece of her art. Look at this. I mean... I know it doesn't relate to Mustangs, but it's just so beautiful that I had to showcase it because there might be an artist out there that's going to key in on one of these keywords, and I'm going to put that on our on our meta tag so it can be found on video. This one's really cool. This is a geode druzy. So in the center of the wall piece, the geode, you know, some of us have seen these round balls and they've been cut open. And this is a druzy which jewelry is made out of. And so that's very special here again, embedded in my clay and then painted. Really nice stuff. We didn't get a chance, we didn't get a chance to see this because all we were looking at was a Mustang. But since we're visiting and picking up the Mustang, we got an opportunity to see their front, just the front of their house is so gorgeous. I knew that, that, that Lee was in the art business and I saw the influence and I just had, I, when I see something this beautiful, I got to show it. I know it's not a Mustang guys, but, but look at this artwork. I mean, wow. Very nice. Thank you so much. Very nice. I appreciate it. Very, very much. Neat. So Lee, Lee's showing us the fossils that she puts into her artwork that she gets. Think, there no, that's not a pair, but they come, like this is an ammonite from uh, Madagascar. And so this is the, the sea creature that they're looking at one half. So this is the outside of it. And you can wow. see it's from Madagascar. They cut it open. And so it comes like these two aren't a pair, right. but they come like you get this. Both, you get both halves. Yeah, you get both halves. And you can see, look at this beautiful opalescence in yeah. here. And then these are the chambers of kind of what it's related to the Nautilus of today. And uh, this is what gives me my inspiration I on my pieces. Yeah. I think they're just, and here again, no two are alike other than the half. Right. And, uh, and here I'm working on a piece I started yesterday, painting this piece. And see how beautiful that fossil is in the center? Right. That one comes from Morocco. Wow. And Morocco and Madagascar tend to have the most beautiful colors in the pieces. And here's one I finished yesterday. Holy cow, look at the size of that piece. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. And look at the colors and look at the crystals inside. Yeah, that's See amazing. that crystals? Isn't yeah. that neat? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Really and then I'm also inspired by real fish fossils. Over there, you'll see the real fish. Careful, I don't know what's on the floor. Yeah, but anyway, there's real fish fossils and ammonites, a crinoid sea lily in the bottom right that looks kind of like a little... That's a crinoid. That would be an ancient, um, like, kind of flower from the oceans. Here again is another pyrite, and this is a sun pyrite out of the coal mines in Sparta, Illinois. 
Neat. So, Neat. give me my inspiration. That's this is my well, older work. I knew you would yeah. do a geode, and there it is. <laughs> oh, wow. This is a geode. You gotta see the geode. You gotta this see the one, geode. This is actually sure? called a septarian slice. It's from Utah. And here again, here is what the slice looks like. Uh, all different. And, oh, oh, <laughs> okay. So anyway, I had this in a piece, and the piece broke, and so I... I'll, I'll edit that out. Yeah, I know. It's, it's, no, I didn't break it. The, ga the, the gallery broke it. But and there's a finished piece there. Neat, really neat Ooh. stuff. Wow. Ooh, this one down here. Isn't that cool? This one. This one? This one? Yeah, okay, here I'll pick one. that up for you. So you can see it. Yeah. See, little did you guys know, you're watching a Mustang Medic video and you're on a gallery showing off. So you <laughs> never know what you're going to get at Mustang Medic. Isn't that beautiful fall? Please look for the link in the description below for the next in our series. If it's not there, come back soon. We take the frustration out of restoration. So you say it only has surface rust? Really?